back to kicking it with Christine. Thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate that. Before we get started, head over to YouTube, type in kicking it with Christine. Make sure you like the videos, share the videos, and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate it. I truly do. Um, and then what you're going to want to do is head over to Instagram and Facebook and follow me on both platforms. I appreciate that. So today, guys, today I'm going to do a little lunch with you. Um, it's very simple. You know, I just did a personal pizza and then I have bison chip dip. It's a staple in Buffalo, Western New York. I have some bell peppers and I have some broccoli and cauliflower and I'm drinking water. Before I get started, we're going to say our prayer and I'll take a thumbnail and then we'll get started. Okay. Dear Lord, thank you for these gifts that we're about to receive. In Jesus name we pray. Amen. And I'm just going to hold up a bell pepper. Actually, I should hold up the dip because everybody loves bison's chip dip and some peppers who doesn't love bison chip dip <laughs> vegetables bread um crackers chips anything used so i know some people that eat pizza with it oh and i have pizza so um i'm ready to get started i'm starving today I hope you guys have something very good to eat with you right now as you're watching. It's worth it to come to Buffalo just for the food. And this chip dip, I know my friends in Texas, they can't get it. I don't think Florida could get it either. I actually think it's a New York thing. If I'm wrong, let me know in the comment section down below. Mm, 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 mm. This could have been an ASMR video because <laughs> there's a lot of chewing. I'm thinking about doing ASMR. Let me know if you guys would want to hear that. <laughs> you would literally be listening to me eat. That was what the channel was supposed to be, so I didn't have to talk. But it went in a couple different directions. I know I promised you guys that I was going to do a challenge for this episode. I put it off for one day. I'm still going to do the challenge, but I'm going to include somebody in on it. It is going to be so much fun. You are going to love it. So you have to stay tuned. So I just have a cheese and pepperoni pizza. Stuffed crust. I was dying for pizza today. Mmm. And I love a crusty pizza. I like the crispiness of the bottom. Ooh. Yeah, I dipped it in my, my uh, chip dip. You should try it. Mm. So guys, what's going on? How is everybody doing? I love these bell peppers. They're perfect. I could eat bell peppers 24 hours a day. They're so good. So it's Friday. You'll actually see this video Sunday. I was talking to somebody today and I guess Ellicottville is going on this weekend. 
This year flew back, flew by so fast. It's just unreal how quick it went by. We're in October, people. It's like maybe 10 weeks away or less to Christmas. Oh my gosh. Who started their Christmas shopping? Who wants Christmas episodes? Let's get to Thanksgiving first. We could bypass Halloween. <laughs> Not a big Halloween person. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Look at the cheese. It's definitely um, stuffed in my crust. <laughs> I cracked myself up. Mmm, it's just gushing. I love it. This is so good. Mm -hmm. I was so hungry. I might not talk a lot during this episode because I'm 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 really hungry. So tell me what kind of fruits and vegetables you guys like to eat. I like to eat any kind of vegetable. Except for beans. I'm not really a great lover of beans. Mm. I do like black beans in my salad. I mean, I guess I would do baked beans, but they have to be flavored really good, like barbecue or something. I think I'm going on the boat again this weekend. I think it's like the last day that we're he's going to keep the boat out. So, last weekend actually. Mm. So I'm excited to be about being on the boat. I love being on the boat. It might be an Aquarius thing, but I just love it. And that, then the speed, the fast, hitting the waves, you know, you're go driving fast on the water. Best feeling ever. Besides sitting in the Mustang flying down the street. I bet you guys didn't know I was a girl. They had a need for speed. <laughs> I totally do. Mm. I really, really, really want a charger. We'll see. Because I don't just want a charger. I want a souped up charger. Your girl's into fast carbs. But not fast money. <laughs> and I'm not acting funny. Oh, I'm a I'm a I'm a rapper and didn't know it. So this weekend I don't really know I don't really have plans for this weekend. Besides going on the boat. I got some running around to do, but we'll see. I would love to do Alcott though. I just found out about it today, or I would be doing it or planning to go, you know, with my friends. But who knows? Maybe I'll find some time to do it this weekend. So I got a lot of responses about back about me doing new videos. I didn't know you guys missed me that much. I'm getting text messages, Instagram messages, Facebook messages, comments on the YouTube page. People are messaging me. I'm like, oh my god, I didn't even really think it was such a big deal. You know? 
or that you guys would miss me so much. But I'm thankful. And that is very flattering, so thank you. I do have a lot of new plans for the channel. The problem is I don't have a lot of time to make the, chan the channel changes as quickly as I'd like it. But it's happening. Be patient. I feel like I'm stuffing my face. I'm just so hungry today. That is really good. Look at the cheese. Can you see the cheese inside of that? I really wanted pizza. I'm so glad I, I got it. So can't stop eating. I don't want to stop. I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos on Asian food. I'm so intrigued by it. Even like the desserts. Chupalupa, I forget the name of it. I think it's Chupalupa or some, something like that. Please don't kill me if I said the wrong name. Um, but then I like try to find them like in the restaurants around here and they don't really have, they don't really have a lot of the desserts. I'm dying to try the desserts. Like just different things I've been seeing. And we have a big Asian community here. So I'm like really surprised that, you know, you can't find some of the desserts. Like I want to try the sticky rice with the mangoes. I don't know if anybody ever had that try it or tried it. If you did, let me know. I guess that's big in Thailand. I don't know if I'll ever be able to visit Thailand, but one of the YouTube file, YouTube mukbangers is from Thailand. I love her, and she's visiting right now her family, so she's showing all these desserts and these foods I never even saw, or even vegetables I've never. I've never even heard of. So it's intriguing to me. And then when I'm bored, I'm looking up these Thai restaurants in, you know, Western New York and checking out their dessert menu, even their regular menus and trying to find the desserts. It's like, it's not there. A lot of it's boba tea or Thai iced tea or sticky sticky rice and um i don't think it, they have sticky rice with the mango around here but there's other things too that i can't pronounce the words that i'm dying to try even the moon cakes they make them with bean paste and some of them look really good it's like the mochi filling. 
the real mochi filling. I'm just really intrigued by it. I just want to taste it. I like tasting different cultures, different, you know, different flavors that I've never had before, spices. That's what's so beautiful about the United States. We have everything in our country. Every kind of spice, every kind of nationality. You're like a melting pot. A melting pot. And it's so amazing to be able to, you know, share your culture with other people that never had your food, your cuisine. And also tasting the cuisines you've never had. It's, it's amazing. I love it. if anybody knows where I could get um, Asian desserts let me know put it in the comment section down below I'm dying to know I know there's some places in Toronto to offer the ones that I'm looking for but that's I think the border's still closed Or you have to have an enhanced driver's license, in which I don't. I have a passport. But. Hmm. Maybe I'll get one. Maybe I won't. This pizza is so good. Move it up. Raw vegetables are the best. You get more nutrients from the raw vegetables than steaming them or cooking them. It takes it sucks the the it sucks it right out of it. You need those nutrients. I'm getting full, guys. I told you I'm not going to be able to talk that much. I'm eating chewy food. Not chewy, but crunchy food. Takes forever to chew. If you have any suggestions, Mama said don't ever talk with your mouth open. If you have any suggestions for any upcoming shows that you want to see, please let me know. Give me some ideas. Give me some restaurants that you're dying to see or me, you know, showcase on a channel. Um, I'm going to do a couple stores. Keep, keep watching. Make sure you hit the notification bell so you're notified when new content is uploaded. Um, for the stores that are going to be featured on my channel. And guys, I'm full. So I just want to say thank you for joining me today. And again, head over to YouTube. Subscribe to Kicking It With Christine. Follow and uh, like my pages on Instagram and Facebook. Send me a message. We can contact each other. We can talk through messaging. I'm down to hear any ideas that you have. Um, or, you know, like I said, restaurants you want me to showcase. Um, and basically, guys, I'm going to get into my weekend. So, again, thanks for watching and I appreciate it. See you next time on Kicking It With Christine. Peace. Bye.